There's absolutely no point in you hanging around waiting. I thought we agreed I'd support you. You already have. By dropping me off and checking I'm OK. Now, if you stay with me while I'm in there, I'll only feel bad for wasting your time. I honestly don't mind. Aye, look who it is. Oh, yeah? You're not here for a session, are you? My last one. Oh, great. Congratulations. This is my partner, Doug. Doug, this is Gordon. Hello, hi. He's been mothering me for having company. And now you're here, so you can go and pot around that garden centre we passed. All right, all right. As long as you phone me, as soon as you know when you're going to finish. Good luck. So, have you been? Apart from the cancer, obviously. Obviously. Fine. I'm selling my half of the pub. Really? Yep. Seize the day and all that. Although, keep stum, cos I haven't told Chas yet. Well, I was open to bump into you for that very same reason. Me seizing the day. Oh, yes. Yeah, ever since we talked, I thought of nothing else. I can't get Chaz and Anne out of my head. So I've decided to give it a try, getting in touch. Maybe even make another go of it. Oh, wow. That's a bit of a turnaround. I know. And I was hoping that maybe, well, you'd help me out with it all. When I said you should get in touch, I didn't mean straight away. I'm just not sure now's the right time. Look, I'm not asking you to matchmake or anything. I just want to get in contact, smooth things over. I'm not expecting miracles. That's probably for the best. Look, all I need from you is a bit of support. The odd kind word here or there. Not even a kind word, really. Just don't jump to agree when she says I'm a total waste of space. Of course, but... Chaz has been through a lot recently. I'm sure you heard about the helicopter crash. Of course. I wasn't sure whether she still lived there. Was she hurt? She was shaken up. A lot of us were. But then she got involved in a dispute. She saw someone get shot. Oh, my God. It knocked her for six. Of course. She was diagnosed with post-traumatic stress. She's having treatment at the moment. Poor thing. So you can see why now might not be the best time. I can't believe it. She's always been so strong. Not that I'm saying this is, you know. Did she know the person who was shot? I. It's not really my place. Of course. I'm not looking for gossip. Poor Jazz. Aaron must be taken hard to. He's had his own problems. I just think it would be best to let the dust settle a bit. Let them get through Christmas. Maybe get in touch in the new year. Nurse said we might be a while yet. I think I'll pop down and get a paper. Do you want anything? No, I'm fine, Tom. Got it. Good. Well, I would say don't be a stranger, but it sounds like that isn't what you've got in mind. Congratulations on getting through chemo with your hair intact. What can I say? It's my finest achievement. I know I wasn't the best father. I messed things up with Aaron and Chaz. That's why I want to make amends. How's it been lately? I know he had some problems growing up. Well, I'm not going to lie. He's had his fair share of bother. Well, then, I should shoulder some of the blame for that. I should have been there for him. There's no point in regretting what's past. Why don't I test the waters for you? Mention your name, see how he reacts. You do that for me? Well, I'm not promising anything, but... No, listen, anything you can do, that would be brilliant. Thank you. We chemo gang have got to stick together, haven't we? I'd like that. Thank you. <laughs> 